a true artist never gives up. Ever. And you're going to deal with some tough things your entire life. Most artists that I know have always been told, pretty much right off the bat, from your parents, your family, pretty much the most influential people in your life, that you can't be an artist or what, what you, don't, don't become an artist, you know, don't do that. There's no money in it. There's no, um, there's no future in it. It's so tough, blah, blah, blah. What they don't understand is that for the artist, there's nothing else. There's, uh, for us, doing other things that are, like, working for other people, doing kind of meaningless stuff is bad. It's, it's terrible. It just, it, it's like an almost, a, we have an allergic reaction to it. And it's because that's not what we're truly meant to be. A lot of people will have those negative, almost allergic reactions to moments or things that they do, paths that they choose, that aren't, may not be perfect for them and they just kind of ignore the signs and keep going with it. But the artist, you'll, get, you'll deal with a lot of stuff, a lot of hardships, unbelievably, starting with that. People will always, some people, you may be lucky to have people that kind of guide you, but inevitably it's going to come down to money, and inevitably it's going to, it's going to be tough. There's going to be hardships. Never give up. Just l last week, I got another op an opportunity from an artist agent and uh, I've had these come and go throughout the years it's so frequently it's ridiculous. People that I've talked with, met with, signed contracts with, and then nothing. I've never made a penny from any of them. And, uh, and a lot of times the contract will be cancelled or, or, or I won't even get to the contract. It'll be about to sign it. One instance, there was this art agent who sounded great. I met her in, um, on our cross-country trip. She was very interested in representing us, had great plans. She worked at a great gallery, a popular gallery. Things were going great. She told me she was all this stuff. She had all these big plans. She had kind of graduated recently, so she was ready to go. And um, right when we were about to sign it, all of a sudden she started talking about us paying her all, all this money, 400 plus dollars. And ooh, we didn't have that at the time. Her attitude immediately changed from being a nice person to someone that was vengeful and became pretty mean. And it was, it was weird, that ended. Thankfully we didn't sign that. Another person I signed with, no idea, never talked to the person again. And uh, it's just, you, you'll have this happen, people email you, everything seems great, gone. They disappear, tattoos. Oh, will you draw this tattoo for me? Never, I've had 1,000 plus people ask for a tattoo. I have never heard an email from any of them. I've given every one of them a flyer. So it's, you're battling with people that, you know, you have, to, you have to convince them that your art is worth their money compared to other things, and it's, it's tough. And um, money kind of leads to a lot of hardships. But never give up, ever. You do it for the drawing. Always do it for the drawing. Always have a thousand ideas ready to go. Have a playlist in your head of things that are next. What comes next? Each day I wake up, and have a list of things in my head that I want to accomplish that day. And I don't, pretty much don't go to sleep until that is done. And, you know, and that's where you have to be. You have to keep going no matter what. No matter, there, there, there will be no reward. If you probably averaged out the amount of money I've made with art compared to the amount of time I've spent, I'd probably made an average of 10 cents an hour for my entire life. For all the time I've been drawing, at least, maybe 25 cents. And whatever. <laughs> I'm unbelievably happy. It is not a problem. It will it, come in time, I hope, or just trust, and um, you know, and that's all you can do. And but if you work hard, you keep working hard, you're gonna get better. You're gonna get past those those people who gave up, who maybe they had a, a big thing, they had a big gallery, and nobody came. I had kind of that happen once, and it, I was crushed for about ten minutes. And then I was use it for fuel, and I was back ready. I was like, "That's it. I'm, I'm, up, I'm gonna make the next one better. I'm gonna keep going." That was about five years ago, so you really can't go up. But you know, some moments are gonna be tough, but absolutely never even fathom giving up. It is, the art is a thing that you can do no matter what. You can have another job and then have art, and it's not just a hobby. Hobby is used for things like drawing little crafts and like build, tweaking little model planes or something, I don't know, I'm sorry, 
I'm not insulting that, but art is something that's just growing inside you forever, and you it can you cannot let it uh, be unused. It has to be used. When you're an artist, you never will stop. Nothing will get in your way. Every single person that says, ha, or laughs at you, or is like, looks down at you, just turn that, process that into fuel, and just keep going. Work even harder. Get even less sleep the next day. Try even harder. Develop a new method. Research further. Just explore things. Think. Meditate on ideas. Just make them masterful. Keep going. You have it in you, don't let anyone tell you otherwise. If, you know, you know maybe some people may try the art path and then realize that it's not for them. That's fine, your, your, your other path is waiting. But for those who are the art warriors, who know they are, can't think of doing anything else, keep going, you will find it. I will find it, hopefully. Not hopefully, <laughs> will, trust in it. Believe in the power of it. Being an art warrior is an ever-growing process and nothing can get in the way of this dream. This happiness that comes from creating art, the joy that comes from people that appreciate it and truly understand it, the, the thrill of just being in the moment and drawing and thinking about all these beautiful things, it's priceless. There's no way to put any value on it. No jewel, no nothing. That, that little bug was amazing. This stuff is priceless. And embrace nature, embrace everything, embrace the world around you, find your creativity, let nothing stop you. Never.